Hey everybody, Brian with you from the game coming. We're playing some more Stellaris. Oh, that was great. I knocked over my coffee like right as I hit the record button. Uh, but um, it, it's in a mug, so it didn't matter, but still. Uh, okay, so you're missing action, unspent traits, relic activation possible. I think this is all fine. You're building on that. All right, let's go speed three. We are still trying to get through and take over the system. I don't really want to use my main fleet just because. So piracy is suppressed now over here. Okay, good. Do we have piracy anywhere else? No. I wonder why we have piracy there. I wonder if it's not me. I wonder if maybe it's like reacting to one of the other civs. Because I, I thought we couldn't get piracy. Eh, it's fine. So we will need him healed up. I do want to keep building up these navies here. We do have 2.4k. I think I'm going to do that. Let's just keep building up the fleet. If he's at 130, he might be almost as strong as Gray at that point. Uh, system surveyed, sure. We have some crazy amount of tech right now, which is good. Um, but yeah, I would love to just absolutely kill these guys. That would be great. Uh, oh yeah, we are at war. I was like, aren't we at war? I was like, we should declare war on the Kelazan Republic. Wait a second, we're at war. Uh, by the way, oh, we were saving our influence for... Yeah, that dude was offering us something. I don't remember what he was offering us, but we wanted to save our influence for that. One of the... The, 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 I can never think of their names. The... Rocket New Tech. Rocky New Tech. Uh, what the freaking heck is their name? I don't even see them. Oh, yeah, uh, the troops. But what what's their actual name, though? Uh, curators. Remember, resources from jobs. Okay, that's pretty fine. Society research, starbase capacity, naval capacity, terraforming gas. I just don't care about any of these anymore. Uh, I guess give me society research. Uh, wait, how slow was that one? Was that a 20,000 one? Or, yeah, 20,000. I mean, it's not that bad in the scheme of things. I just, you know... Would rather work on something a little bit quicker, but sure. Armies I don't care about. Gray is still not back. Research that. Okay. Uh, declare rivalry. Oh, okay. Were we not able? I thought we were not able to rival them. I guess because they just bumped up to equivalent. Uh, and I guess we just immediately had that happen. Ongoing lacks research. Oh no, our leader died. Oh no, that's sad. That's really sad. So uh, what we can do though is we have a couple Spark of Geniuses commanding. So I might as well go switch them off and then I'll go buy a guy here. So sure, recruit available. Maybe use that guy instead here instead of the Spark of Genius. But then again, he's level one. This guy's level three. The the rocket dude's probably still quicker, but I'm just going to leave him because I don't really feel like min-maxing that right now. Construction ship is done. We finished everything here. That's okay. You are going to go up there, but like I said, we're saving our influence for now. I think we needed 150, if I remember correctly. System surveyed, robbery, yeah, yeah, yeah. Sign ship. Oh, yeah. We wanted to put you in the system. Well, right now, let's just chill. Uh, Gray is back. Gray is definitely back. Let's go ahead and have you heal. Terraforming cannon discovered. Kill. So, he's still got a lot of troops there, but no 9k troops. 9k armies. This one's actually 10k now. That's fine. What are we at? 17k? I'm really debating about potentially putting our navy here. All of it going. So, they are now xenophilic. So... Increased opinion of other species. We have border frictions. They have claims. The xenophages should go away, correct? Allied arrivals, hive minds. Yeah, I was wondering if we could be friendly with them. Doesn't look like it. You are doing what? Oh, you just finished that system. Yeah, go back to automatic. System surveyed, migration tree. Actually, no, 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 no. You were from wet rock yeah i moved you over here from wet rock i remember what's rock assist research beautiful migration treaty broke or something i didn't i wasn't paying attention <laughs> just to be honest i was not paying attention all i care about is getting this guy fully healed and then going blowing up some people 
That's all I really want to do in life. Well, and finisher tech. Speaking of which, kinetic batteries. Nice. Destroyer hold points. Mining station output. Yes. I want the mining station output because we're still struggling over here. Another leader died. That's our envoy. That's fine. I don't care if our envoys die. Uh, gray is full HP. We can't give you a leader. Yeah, just double checking. Let's go move you out over here. There you go. This time, though, when you get there, I kind of hope you actually finish killing people. Like, last time you got a little distracted. I think he was going for the star base, which I would rather you not. I would rather you just come blow up this fleet. Actually, go blow up this guy. It's a single ship. So blowing up the single ship's pretty easy. Same thing there. He's really hurt. He never gained HP back. Okay. Those are just giant ships. Uh, I don't know if they are juggernauts or if they're colossus. So let's see, you got spawning pools. You're gonna have a lot of energy. Let's go ahead and start building those out. We might wanna go ahead and convert you. But for now, I'm not too worried. So we finally finished. What, what's our fleet even look like? Fleet manager. We have battleship cruisers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't think we can do bigger than battleships, right? And then we got the Federation. Yeah, battleship's still my biggest ship. So we don't have the Colossus. I think you can only do one total Colossus, correct? Yeah, one Titan, one Colossus, one Juggernaut. What class are you? A Galleon? Okay, so how big's a Galleon? <laughs> What's gray? Mothership. Yeah, what what size are you, buddy? I'm not sure. Yeah, I'm still not sure how that one works. So we're almost at 150. I think we'll wait till 200 till we actually start buying some of the other districts or some of the other things that we were talking about. What does this mean? Overcrowding. We don't have housing. Oh, interesting. Let's do some housing. We'll build a couple districts. That's fine. And give me one extra generator and then one mining. And I think that's all my districts. So then we're good there. That's fine. Archaeology site discovered. Doesn't really matter because it's nowhere close to me. How are we not winning this war right now, please? We actually lost one? It looks like. Which is really disappointing. Just have to say, kind of disappointed in our people. Did we ever get the black holes? I think we did. I just don't really care right now. Building upkeep, district upkeep. Yes. And then energy credits. Yes, that's what we want. So building up keeps going to increase that a little bit. And then giving the extra energy credits is just going to be so nice. So you're finishing, but you're on auto explorer. Yep, yep, yep. We still need to work at Fianita. Fianita? <laughs> it's an interesting system. All right, come on, Gray. I believe that you can destroy them. I don't know what I was going with. Hello. They're now available to hire. Okay. Good to know. I want you to go do... I'm not going to spend all my crap. I was going to spend the money because my thought was, hey, we could go have him maybe move some of his fleets away. But not if I have to spend all my money. That's not worth it. I think I'm going to take Ripper Cannon too. Star Fortress 2 might be good as well. Or Star Fortress does that open up others? No, it does not. Since Gert, give me Ripper Cannons. Since we're pretty much already there. Alright, where are you at? Where are you at, Gray? Any second here. 12, 11, 10, 9. Uh, he went raiding. One of his fleets went raiding. Dude, so we wrecked his shields, but look at how quick uh, or how hard it is to actually kill his armor. Yeah, we're having some trouble here. I want to kill that mothership. We're actually going to end up winning this one. Okay. Oh, shoot. I need you to retreat. Oh, that's BS that I can't retreat. <gasps> 
Six, five, four, three, two, one. Oh my god. <laughs> that sucked that I engaged that second battle, man. Woo. Yeek. Jump drive. Yes. 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 Yes, please. Oh my god, yes, please. That's all I want. Jump drive. That's going to take a long time, though. 28 months. Eh, not so bad. So, let's see. We did not die. Okay, we did kill a outpost. We killed some frigates and cruisers. That's good. Then this one, we killed raiders, frigate, cruisers. We killed a galleon, asteroid, outpost, and a galleon. Dude, great did work. He did some good work. I like it. Good, good. So, he's pretty weak now. We're going to be able to knock him out here in a minute. Yeah. Yeah, he's not he's, he doesn't have much left. I dig it. Where are they raiding, I wonder? What if they're going to raid us? Eh. Hopefully Gray comes back in time if they're going to raid us. Were we doing Starbase? No, we did the Autocans, that's right. Okay, so our union is level three. Which I think we were already level 3, right? We're gaining 10 XP per turn. That's just going to take forever. Do we actually need to leave our envoys here? No. We can move some of the envoys, I think, over then to the galactic community. Because, like, what else are we doing? Okay. So now we're doing Senate floors, currently the sanctions. And Mirian and the Quivisorian are both in breach. I like it. Uh, and then this is also... Yeah, sure, we'll do that. We can't emergency measure yet. I wonder if there's any other ones we actually care about pushing. I mean, I'm going to be honest. Some of these are cool, but, like, I don't necessarily care. enough to spin stuff like i also don't really even want to sit there and like spend the time trying to figure it out it's like it's very minor benefits which is okay but it's like one of those things where it's like do i really want to spend the brain power trying to figure out which is our best option here and the answer is i don't think so yeah i don't think i do i don't think i will i don't think i will uh okay because at this point it doesn't really matter like we're fine we're totally set, I think. The only concern is going to be in-game crisis. That one's going to suck for us. I don't know if there's anything we can do to help us come in-game crisis, but we'll see. So we never did the strikers. I don't think I care about. Give me the Goss cannons. Yeah. Yeah, it opens up more tech, too. I almost want to go ahead and, and put this inside our system, but we'll hold off. Just a little bit longer. Freeloaders are getting absolutely destroyed. Dude, I love Gray, man. He's so good. Uh, spring cleaning. Would you be willing to do us a favor? Gain us some minerals. Okay. Yep. Thank you. I will totally help you spring clean anytime you want. Uh, a little scientist leveled up. Good. 189. Almost there. Almost there. I do hate how they're coming over here, but like we can so easily take this over. We will build as much as we can, and then we'll use our influence just to go claim all this stuff. Uh, resolution's been passed. Okay. So guess who now has sanctions? Both of these guys. So because they have sanctions, they are losing administrative and diplomatic influence cost. <laughs> ah, that sucks. That sucks. Why are you guys so weak, by the way? Who are you fighting? Who, like, destroyed your army? You're hostile. Are you at war with anyone? Yes. Oh, against us. Oh. Alright. So we blew up his fleet, apparently. I thought we were fighting someone else. I thought we were fighting these guys. We are. Huh? Oh, Hazakas's Belli. Oh, that's not at war. He was fighting the Bruvian Nation. Okay, so he got blown up by uh, this other group. And then who are we fighting? We're fighting. <gasps> ah, I didn't even realize interesting it's the grand galactic union versus the pan galactic pact it's the battle of the uh, of the two strongest federations i almost should go ahead and move my my uh, uh dude over here just start blowing them up but we're already conquering some of their stuff oh yeah we're fine i'm not gonna worry about it i'd rather kill this guy off that directly helps us
I mean, I want to make our federation awesome, but, you know, I also don't really care that much. <laughs> like, like, here's the thing. As long as we're not losing, that's all that matters. Galactic Emergency Measure Declared. Guardian Angels Act. Ooh, okay. Who was this? Is the Zappa dudes? Yeah, the Zeppa Dragon. All right, so this is the Guardian Angels Act, which does what? Diplomatic weight from fleet power. We lose. Uh, no, we don't want that one. That basically makes us weaker. So we're gonna say no. Yeah, we need 15K in here. Mandate of Grindar. Hey, would you vote with me? I love how the mandate's now number two. Call in favor. So does that mean he's going to vote with us? I have no idea. Hi. How? Let's hold up one sec. I want to see. I want to see what happens if he's going to vote over here. Yeah, he did. Yeah, he did. So how would I get him to come over here? Do I have to like call in a favor or do I have to like trade him a favor? Like if I do this, I say, hey, I want to offer a trade deal. I want you to give me a favor. Oh, man, he'll give me he'll give me a lot of favors. Yeah, and then I will give you what do we have a lot of right now? Uh, volatile moats, we have a thousand, so this should be very easy to grab. Okay, so we accepted that, and then I call in favor. Oh, I see, so it only gives part of their thing? I don't have enough influence. We'll boost your diplomatic weight with... Oh, so do I steal some of his diplomatic weight? That's what that sounds like. 3.4k. Yeah, I actually get extra diplomatic weight. Oh, that sucks. System geology so how do I get them to actually vote for this? Is there no way to be like, yo, I need you to vote with me on this one? Huh, we're really close. All I need is essentially 2,000. Which is 150. Yeah. Yeah, I want this one to oppose, definitely. I wonder... Because we will basically lose diplomatic weight from fleet power. So the larger our fleet, the less diplomatic power we have. Because right now we have mutual defense. We have military readiness act, which gives us plus 40%. And then what they're trying to do is pass rules of war, which is the exact opposite. Defense, army morale. Demobilization initiative. Oh my gosh, dude. The militarized economy. Wow. Yeah, that's bad, man. We don't want that. We do not want that. So the problem is we're spending all of our influence on this. So has leveraged their council, system surveyed, fleet ordered cancel, which is kind of bad. Yeah, it's, it's really bad that they passed this. But there's not much we can do about it. Go on auto explore. Are you, there literally is nothing? Okay. Then you might as well come up here and assist research or something. Uh, society research gain cool. Occupation convolutions of thought. Sure, that's a late game building. I'll go grab that. Uh, then we need some buildings over here. We're good on energy again. Chemical plants, uh, nanite producer. I think we could do another nanite, right? Yeah, we could do another nanite transmuter. 
I think I will. Just because I need it. And then you are out of jobs. I guess get a couple of agricultural districts. Sure. Dude, I hate the fact that they passed that, man. That's annoying. Okay, so you're basically stuck, then, is what you're telling me. Can you not subspace? Fleet cannot be evasive. There you go. Subspace all the way over to here. I don't know if that's doing it. No? How do you subspace again? There you go. There you go. It's a left click. Okay. Where's Gray, by the way? He's back. He's healing. Come on, Gray. Get you healed. Uh, another building. This is a mining world. Mm. We will have some generators, so I will go grab an energy grid, because why not? Uh, and then, honestly, like we have the stuff right now. Just start building this. We only have five housing, so it's going to be a bit of a housing issue here eventually, but for now, it's fine. You are out of jobs. There's literally nothing I can do because I have no districts, so you guys are just going to be jobless. <laughs> Welcome! Welcome to the coronavirus world. Oi. Oi, oi, oi. So, how's Gray looking? Fine. You're fully healed, Gray. Let's go kill. Sounds good. Gray, I want you... Uh, we have to wait till we actually get close enough to see. Uh... Galactic Community, Senate floor. Let's freaking go. We are winning. Boom. Yeah. Good, 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 good. I really want these guys to vote with me, man. I, I wish there was a way to ask them to vote with you. Like, I understand the favor thing. I don't like how it works. I really don't. I, I feel like you should be able to call in the favors for free. What's the point of a favor if I have to spend influence on it? I feel like the favors should just be free. If I'm giving you something, I should be able to call in the favor. And I feel like the favor should be, hey, you need to vote for this as opposed to this weird system. I guess the whole reasoning for it. Yeah, and I guess it makes sense from the standpoint of they can't put half their weight over here and part of their weight over there. But it's just weird that I literally called in like 10 favors or 8 favors with the guy and he still has this 3.5k over there. I think it should at least reduce that. Alright, this is definitely going to fail. So I probably didn't need to put so much weight behind it. Unless some of these guys switch. Now, the guys, obviously, that have tiny armies are a little concerned with it. They don't want it. Which, you know, obviously makes sense. But they're just gonna have to deal with it. <gasps> okay, I'm gonna win. Mandate of Grindar and Kelazan Republic. Yeah, I would might not actually be on the council if this passed. Who's currently council members? There we go. So Galactic Council is Trove, Grindar, and Zepidon. So Zepidon is actually gonna lose to the Kelazan Republic. Hmm, interesting. Is wasn't Zepidon the one that called this one in? I think the Zepidon was the one that called this one in, which is rather interesting because that probably means that they felt like, oh god, we're gonna lose our consuls, so this is why we need to pass that. It's kinda interesting. Mishar Trade Commission's Oh, this is his thing. Okay. I, I dig this, don't get me wrong. I think this is a really cool thing. God, I didn't need to waste all my influence. Um I still think it needs a little bit of tweaking though. Number one. Like, I think, I hate to say this, but like this requires too much brain power. <laughs> it, it doesn't make like the most sense. Like, I, I think once you start understanding it, it, it's not that bad. Like, okay, these basically all give you extra diplomatic weight for having a huge economy. These lose diplomatic weight for having too much. Never mind. These give you diplomatic weight as well, but then they, okay. Then these are sanctions. So it kind of works that way. Denouncement. What's this one? Denouncing modifier. Denouncement. Oh, so we could actually denounce certain systems or certain people. Eh, okay, but what does the denouncement do? Does the sanctions also denounce? Yeah, okay. So this is essentially, uh, we could basically just put sanctions on people. Maybe, 
Maybe, maybe. It, it's not that hard. Like, once you see it, it's like, okay, this actually kind of makes sense. But it does take a little bit of brain power. A little more brain power than I like. Um, I kind of almost want to hold off here. Because... If he does a lot of attacking and we lose a little bit of power, I don't think it's going to affect things, but still, I'd rather just be a little passive for now. Just until we finish this election. We are winning, but still not by a whole lot. Migration treaty, I don't care. Give me this freaking council, man. Also, what are we looking here? 14? Yeah, we're doubling now. I have 9k support. <laughs> So, this would be 10... I mean, if they all went over there, maybe. Maybe they have enough. But remember, I can still call in a little bit more power if needed. Uh, you need... Oh, yeah, we have no jobs. So, that wasn't going to happen. Console, three, two, one. Boom. Rikari Trove, the mandate, and Zeppa. Oh, they ended up winning it back. Wow, at the last minute, they won it back. Okay, then. Okay. Touche. Congratulations. I also feel like... I don't know... When you talk about a Galactic Council and stuff like that, it makes me think of, like, Mass Effect. And I want there to be, like, a Galactic, like... I, I, yeah. A Galactic Navy? Like, I feel like that should be an option. That you can unite the entire universe. Or the, unite the members inside of, uh, basically, a giant Galactic Federation. I feel like, or maybe like force them into your federation or something like that, where then the Galactic Council then has the power to move the Navy around and stuff like that, and then you can, can unite the entire universe against the uh, eventual endgame crisis. Like, stuff like that, in my opinion. That's what I really, really want to see, eventually. Okay, you're going to go blow this guy up, which is just going to absolutely wreck the remainder of their Navy. We'll have a couple star bases. Uh, we should not have too many issues, though, to take over the rest of this. I think we can probably win this. And then we'll probably wrap this episode up. Alright, go kill this guy, hopefully from range. Galactic Council... Okay, hold up, hold up. Yeah, 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 we're fine on that. Uh, new building, sounds good. Leader upkeep, I suppose. Um, and then I'll probably throw this... Honestly? Nah, I should update you. Hold up, hold up. Are we making gases? Yeah, we have a lot of extra gases, so I'll do that, and then we will go ahead and upgrade you. Okay. Alright, let's blow you up. Absolutely wrecking shields. Whatever weapons he's using, he absolutely destroys shields, which is great. Problem is, not so great against hull. So, that begs the question whether or not... I have a manacle. Engineering research. Uh, which one was this? Uh, hand. Mm. I don't think we had the hand. No, we didn't. Mm. Whatever, we'll just put you. You're crap, but sure. Um, maybe my actual navy should be a little stronger against hull. Like, maybe go missiles? Hey, you're actually supposed to be killing this dude. What What are you doing right now? Why are you literally destroying everything else? Thank you. He just one-hit that thing. <laughs> Alright, we're going to completely wipe you out. He did take a little bit of hole damage, but we're fine. So then you're going to go home and heal. Uh, Where is my... What? 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 Where'd my sign ship go that was up here? Huh? Oh, he finished. No. No. I don't know where they went. You're there. You're there. We can always teleport. Or subspace. Oh, he ran away. That's what happened. No, that was the one I jumped. Interesting. Alright, well, we're going to subspace you then. And then when you appear over there, you can go finish that up. Okay, fleet combat stats, good. So, Gray's gonna go heal, and then we're gonna go blow up the rest of the freeloaders. I don't know if that gives us anything special, but sure, why not? I wonder how Gray does against the Fallen Empires. I wonder if they're pretty much the same power level. Star Fortress. I and mean, if we take them one system at a time, since they don't rebuild. Star Fortress. Man... 
I mean, I, I, I have the Nanite one, so I don't really need that. Stormfire auto cannons, I guess. I guess. Kind of like, eh, with all of these. You know, we've never gotten, uh, they never ask us about the influence thing again, so I'm just gonna go ahead and build here and start doing some more archaeology stuff, because archaeology stuff's maybe my favorite thing in the game now. I just wish, like, that stuff, like, the exploring and the archaeology is just, like, the best part of the game, but it's, like, at a certain point, you just don't get it anymore, and that's, like, the most disappointing thing. Like, I want to be able to still do this stuff late game. Like, I feel like you should be able to rediscover some of that stuff. Also, by the way, I still had prospecting. It does require influence. Okay. I was wondering about that. Mmm, building. You're doing a bunch of research right now. We are totally missing jobs, too. Wait. No, that means we have too many jobs. Never mind. Sure. I don't really care. Don't really care. All right. Well, I guess we're going to wrap this episode up here. I wanted to wait for him to come back, but like, let's see, 2207. Oh, that's another four years. Oh my God. I don't think I realized how long subspace took. Ugh, how long are those going to last? 740 days. Oh uh, yeah. I don't, I don't, I don't think we're going to be able to research those. Whoops. Uh, so then what we should do is go ahead and build ourselves a, um, um, a science ship here. <laughs> yeah, we should go ahead and do that and then maybe move one of these guys. We can't take their leaders, but maybe move a leader over there and go finish that up. But yeah, anyways, hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, drop a like, comment, let me know what you think. As always, hit the subscribe button, turn the game, comment, show your support. I'll see you guys next episode. Later, everybody.